Welcome to Insights into Success. We're with your host, Paul Dodds. We hope to educate, inspire, and motivate you to achieve your own personal success. We talk to guests from all around the world from a variety of walks of life to hear the realities of their own journey to success. What challenges have they faced? How have they cope with failure? And what have been the keys or will be the keys to their own success? In our Read to Succeed interviews, we talk books that have inspired our guests. And for some, they share their secrets to marketing success. Join us as we give you insights into success. Welcome to Read to Succeed, where today I thought I'd do something different and actually review a book that I recently read. Now, this book has been written by Arnold Schwarzenegger. It's called Be Useful, Seven Tools for Life. Now, regardless of what you think about Arnold Schwarzenegger, you have to acknowledge he's had an incredible level of success. He's been the number one bodybuilder by winning Mr. Olympia six times. He's also been a Hollywood actor, and he went on to become the governor of California as well. Now, most people would be more than happy to have achieved that level of success in one field, but to have achieved in three different fields is really quite remarkable, particularly when you consider other factors he had, for instance, coming from Austria and that thick Austrian accent he had. Now, in terms of the book, what I've done is made a few notes, and I just want to quickly share them with you. So the seven tools for life, the first message he's got is have a clear vision. Certainly with bodybuilding, he often talked about that and how he would visualize his success before it ever happened. So he's very much a proponent of really thinking about what you want to achieve, getting a really clear vision in your mind and keep living it over and over again until it becomes real. Now, the second suggestion he's got, the second tool is never think small. And you can certainly see from what Arnold's achieved in his life that he's always thought big. And because he had big goals, he's achieved big. Now, the third thing is work your ass off. As far as Arnold's concerned, there is no shortcuts. As much as people online will try and, and, and sell the fact that they've got a way to shortcut um, your success through life, the reality is, as he sees it, you've got to work hard. And I certainly agree with that. Number four is sell, sell, sell. He's all about that you've got to sell yourself in life. And not only to other people, but to yourself. And an example of that is he thinks about how you say things about yourself in order to try and project where you want to go. Now, an example he gave was, you know, saying a statement like, I will be a great bodybuilder and changing that to, I can see myself as a great bodybuilder. So he wants to bring your goals in life uh, into reality as much as possible by you know strong visualization and statements really affirming uh, what you're going to achieve. Number five is shift gears. He says there's no point in focusing on negativity. You've got to accept what happens in life and move on. Find the positive and move on. There's no point in dwelling. It's not going to achieve anything. You must go through life being positive. Number six is shut your mouth and listen. He says that too often people talk too much and don't do enough listening of other people. So he's a real proponent of just sit back and listen to what people are saying and learning from that. Sure, you can talk when you need to, but focus more on listening and learning from other people. And number seven is break your mirrors. It's all about don't focus on yourself. Think about other people. And certainly as he's got older, he's done more and more um, in terms of contributing back to society. What he says there is you're going to get a lot of enjoyment out of it, and ultimately, one way or another, you will benefit. So overall, I thought it was an easy book to read, and I certainly got a lot of value out of it. So I'd well recommend you reading it. Now watch out for other reviews that I'm going to do going forward. 